guys, it's Megan. It's Monday and today is my first day of my week off in between jobs and oh, I'm just living for this week. This is gonna be so awesome. Um, it is pretty chilly. It was 80, between 80 and 90 degrees Friday and Saturday. Then yesterday it was like 40 degrees and now it's like 50 or something. But I'm getting the opportunity to wear one of my favorite sweaters. This is from Ann Taylor Loft and it has really cute shoulder details. It's just like a, a sweatshirt but with like this lacy cutout. I don't know. I think it's really awesome. Um, but today's big plan is to get massages with my mom. My mom took the day off of work, which is awesome that she gets an extra day for her weekend. And so we had breakfast together and then we're going to go to a new spot for lunch that we've both been really wanting to try. And then we have massages this afternoon. I cannot wait. This is something that I wanted to do for a really long time and then there's just never time to do it. Um, so now is like the perfect opportunity opportunity and I'm doing this for her um, birthday gift as well so it's my treat to her and I cannot wait at all so um yeah this week is gonna be really nice and relaxing I only have like a very few plans um, mostly lunch dates with my grandparents to see them and spend more time with them um, but other than that it's just kind of go with the flow each day and I feel like I'll be vlogging a lot which is always awesome and I hope you guys enjoy it but I wanted to talk about two YouTube channels that I've been obsessed with like legit obsessed with I haven't watched TV shows in I don't know, weeks. I've been on a YouTube kick and then recently I've went like so like in love with two specific channels. So the first one my sister introduced me to because it was like a suggested video on YouTube. It's Beauty News, specifically their makeup breakup series and they destroy makeup which sounds terrifying. I was like, what are they doing? They're like savages, but they destroy it in order to weigh it and see if you're getting the amount of product that you're supposed to. They repress it. They like really just investigate the makeup, which is so, so cool and something I've never seen anything like before. So they're from Australia, Kat and Haley. They are so funny and so awesome. I really, really enjoy their personality personalities and I love their videos so I've been binge watching them and I swear my thoughts are in Australian accents now like that's how much I've been watching them <laughs> so um I just like watch any video I'll watch one and then the next suggested one I'll just watch it I don't care what it is I just really really like them so if you've never watched a makeup destroying video by them specifically you need to you will be obsessed too and it's just a really fascinating series i think my favorite episode has been the one on the natasha denona tropic palette they did a lot of in-depth research and comparing her old palette eyeshadows to the ones in the tropic palette because there's been like some controversy over are you getting as much product as you used to and i'll let you guys watch it because it's fascinating. That's like the best word that I can use to, to describe their videos. Then another channel that I have really fallen in love with is someone that actually watches my channel and that is Leora and I will link her below of course but it, Leora has been watching my videos for a while and I didn't realize that she also had a channel. So um, we were messaging on Instagram about mascara. She was telling me about the Maybelline Total Temptation and I ordered that. I can't wait to get that in the mail. Um, and then I went to her Instagram and then I found her YouTube page so I've been binge watching her videos and Leora is so funny and so awesome and she tries out so much makeup that you guys that like love new releases and stuff you will love her channel so much and she does like makeup of the week baskets and like shopping her stash she just went to LA and she had a vlog from that and 
she is just like so sweet and so funny and I just really am enjoying your video videos Leora so um those are two channels that I really really loved and I always like to tell you guys what I'm watching whether it's movies or TV or <laughs> even YouTube channels because I think it's always fun to find new people to watch so if you guys have never watched their videos um either Beauty News or Leora definitely check them out and if you're a fan too let me know because I'm sure a lot of us have very similar tastes in who we like to watch. So I think tomorrow I'm going to see a movie, but I haven't decided what. I really, I really want to see A Quiet Place because I've heard such amazing things about it, but I feel like I'm going to be so scared. I don't watch scary movies. Um, I just really, really don't watch scary movies. Um, so I want to see it because I think it's going to be a good movie, but I'm worried that I'm just going to be so scared. So I probably won't see it. I might see Ready Player One because my parents saw that um, this past weekend when my sister and I saw Blockers. And if you haven't seen Blockers, please go see it. It is one of the funniest movies ever. I loved it so much. I cannot wait to see it again and to buy it when it comes out on DVD. It was so funny and it had a really great message as well. So that's like the perfect mix. It reminded me a lot of Bridesmaids, how it had so much humor, but it was based around a topic that was really an important thing to discuss and also just like work out, like the characters worked it out and seeing their like thought process and how everything went was really interesting. So loved it so so much um but yeah probably tomorrow I'll see a movie and then I have lunch with Gigi and Crampy tomorrow which will be really nice so I'm just gonna be doing whatever the hell I want for this week and I can't wait I guess the last time I was in my car was when it was like 90 degrees because I had the AC blasting but it's only 47 now where is spring please warmth come back we're at the Shelby for lunch and they left water on the table, which is very important to me. It's so cool in here. I love it. Look at mom's cool soda. Oh my god. This is fa fancy living right here. It's like that place by Drexel. Oh yeah. Sorry with a Z, right? Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> We're amused by the littlest thing. Charcuterie. Yeah. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> we are amazed at how giant our portions are. Yeah. Mom got the turkey club or turkey sandwich, and I got the pulled pork with mango salsa. Looks amazing. It it's on. <laughs> so all my tissues, you guys, I keep <laughs> pulling a hole in all of them. Like literally every one. It's ridiculous. <laughs> but I need them because my allergies are so bad. <laughs> I'm all out of sorts. <laughs> Poor. <laughs> this sucks. <laughs> Time for massages. We're done with our massages. It was Two good. thumbs up. Mm -hmm. I look like I'm on drugs. I'm like, woo, <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> it's very, very relaxing. Yeah. We both said we were a little like tense and nervous at first, but then it like yeah. it, you feel more comfortable after like the first few minutes. Yeah, they're they're very professional. Yeah. So. It was not weird like that, but just mm -hmm. felt, I don't know. I know, it's like vulnerable at first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah. exactly the way Because like, especially it. like with your face yeah. down, like you don't know what's going on. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So no, that's... No, but they were really professional and mom signed up for like a monthly thing that she can bring me as a guest. So... My favorite. <laughs> it's going to be awesome. <laughs> <laughs> we're at the danger zone known as Nordstrom Rack and they have Sun Bum, my favorite stuff. I love this brand. And they also have lots of good makeup stuff. Nothing I need. This is a really good deal. It's a um, Bare Minerals palette. I think it's $23. Yeah. But it's very cool toned. There's a lot, a lot of stuff, you guys. You guys, they have Shiseido. I love Shiseido sunscreens. Let's see. 12, $13 for Shiseido sunscreen? That's really, really good. They have Giorgio Armani C with a Armani lip product for $60. It's really good. You guys know I need this light up cactus for my room. <laughs> We're enjoying a Dunkin Donuts snack break. We got some donuts. Look at my overflowing whipped cream. 
is my ice mocha latte. Mom gets a medium iced coffee. Don't get added sugar, people. It's sugary enough, <laughs> especially the latte. But we're gonna go to Bonton because it's closing, which is, oh my gosh, 70 to 90% off the whole store. Okay. I thought it was gonna be like 50. Let's see if they have any makeup. I've been wanting to get one of these. <laughs> oh my God, 70% off. I'm gonna get these um, huggable hangers for $18. They have a bunch of makeup on sale, but none of it is like essential. Um, it's all like 60 and 70% off, which is, I've never seen on makeup, but it's it's more sad than anything that everything's like empty and they're clearing out. And so it puts like a damper on the good deal. All right, now we're at the extra, extra dangerous spot, Marshalls. I found these really cute Toms for $25. I really like those. And I'm seeing some cool um, brush sets. The Real Techniques, this like color correcting set. Let's see how much this says. $8 for that, that's really good. For all these sponges. I'm sure there's gonna be more stuff that I'll discover. Now that we've had a ma uh, massage, we want like pedicures. And look at this cool stuff by OPI. Pedicure scrub, and this looks cool. Hand and nail cream, ooh la la, ooh $5. Might pick that up. I just saw this and I thought this was that new Tarte or Too Faced or whatever palette, but it's, it's not. <laughs> they do have some different makeup. Ooh, they have the Gigi Hadid mascara. Clearly that's not doing very well. <laughs> Lots of mascaras, surprisingly. Um, lashes. Ooh, lots of sponges. They did have some makeup, but look at this. They have a Mac set, but someone stole them. That sucks. They have some Kat Von D lipsticks. Anastasia. Skincare section, where I need to be the most restrained. I'm so much better than I used to be, you guys, but I can't resist looking. Look, they have Kopari, $20. Coconut sheer oil. I don't know what that is. Ooh, there's a lot of ingredients. Hmm. They have a Holika Holika product. Pig clear dust out. I think it's like a cleansing foam. Look at this. Oh my god. I might get this to try and probably give it to Rachel because she loves this kind of stuff, but I can't believe they have K-Beauty here. They have this awesome Bare Minerals set for $17 with the Complexion Rescue, but it's vanilla too, which was way too dark for me. But that's so tempting. They also have this oops, Ole Henriksen set for $14.99. That is a good deal. What did you find? Oh, some slippers? Yeah, for $8. Oh, nice. Oh, wow, look at these. Ooh. Those are some cute Kate Spade. <gasps> short Ooh, I'll have to go look at those. Oh my god, you guys, I just hit the jackpot. They have a bunch of them in different colors. And this is my color, Opal One. Oh my god, oh my god, I'm so excited. Isn't this gorgeous, you guys? It says it's handmade in Thailand. That is so fun. These are the socks my mom found. These are so, oh, are they little monkeys? <laughs> With a rose. And then like different ones. Oh my God, those are so, so cute. They have this Andalou natural set for only $5. Oh, everything's so tempting today. Mask section. Ooh, these Karina ones are on extra sale. Make sure and count the masks before you buy them, because sometimes people steal them. They have Salmon Nick um, sponges for only $2. They have like a cutout in the top, it's kind of weird. Look how cute these are. The Crumb Shop always has the cutest stuff. Glow Up Skin Unicorn Sheet Masks. So adorable. Look at these scarves. Wow, that's so neat. Vince Komodo. Cool. This pretty one, you guys. I like that. They're all so pretty. Ooh, that's nice. Just, just that's cute. Room. Oh, wow. That's very pretty. Mm -hmm. It's so easy to lose each other in the store. <laughs> oh my god. <gasps> Cactus bag. I need it. <laughs> I love these. I love these actually. That's like a useful yes. cactus item. Yes. Unlike my cactus um, ring toss, <laughs> <laughs> but whatever. Should I get a lunchbox you guys for work? Probably should. 
because so I'll probably take lunch. There's some cute ones. How big do I need? How much food am I going to eat? <laughs> How many snacks do I need every day? I'm going to get this one, you guys. It's pretty cute and pretty compact. Let's see the brand. Fit and Fresh, that's me. And <laughs> it's like small, but then it expands all the way. So you can open it and it comes with... Yeah, because I'm going to have a lot of snacks, I'm and sure. Actually, if you wanted to put like those Pyrex Oh yeah, it would fit stuff. in the bottom. Yes, that's the that's nice. Well, maybe you should get one of these too. Be fit and fresh together. So I want to try to find something, you guys, that can hold my sunglasses, because now that I have like a collection. So I'm looking for that, but I found this cute business card holder. holder. Trust me, I'm a professional. <laughs> that is amazing. So true. If I had a makeup room, I would get this sign. Oh my god, so great. At the checkout section, they have OPI Nail Envy for only $10. I have a new bottle, so I don't need it, but look at all this tempting nail polish. I pretty much showed you guys everything I got as we were shopping, but I thought I would just show you what I ended up purchasing. I got these huggable hangers from Bonton, a set of 50 for only $18, which is awesome. I've been trying to completely switch over my hangers to huggables. So these are the pink color, which I think is fun, and it was an awesome deal. At Nordstrom Rack, I got this beautiful scarf. I love scarves for spring and summer and fall um, at work because it's chilly in the office, but I like something lightweight still. And this is just a beautiful colorway. Uh, the Shiseido Ultimate Sun Protection Lotion SPF 50 Plus. This was only $13. And it's like a liquid. Um, I got this mostly for my neck and chest but also my face when I'm at the beach and they did have the Shiseido BB Sport which Lisa Lisa D1 always talks about at Nordstrom or at Marshalls but they only had the medium shade so I'm glad I picked this up at Nordstrom Rack. I got these really pretty earrings love these from Nordstrom Rack they were ten dollars I think they're just so cool I got this lunchbox and we looked for another one for my mom, but they didn't have any of the same style. But this this is just really, really cool. So I'm not sure how, oh, it's called the Charlotte Chiller Bag. So I'll look this up and see if I can find it and link it below. Really, really love these Toms. They're such a cool color. They have a little bit of a sparkle to them and Toms only last me one season so I usually don't purchase them when they're full price but these were $25 so I thought that was a great deal. I ended up getting the OPI Avoplex High Intensity Hand and Nail Cream and I just put it on and it's really nice and you get a lot of product for only, this was only $5. Uh, the Holika Holika Pig Clear Dust Out something something deep cleansing foam I cannot wait to try that and then definitely my favorite purchase of the day was this bare mineral set I couldn't believe they had my color so this was $17 originally $39 and it's the complexion rescue tinted hydrating gel cream which you guys know I tried and really loved and this is my shade opal one Comes with a full-size blush in Golden Gate, which I think is going to be really pretty. A little brush that I'll probably never really use, but we'll see. And then this really cute makeup bag. So that's everything I got. My mom got some really great um, deals as well. So we just had an awesome day together. I just watched this Golden Gate uh, blush, and it is freaking gorgeous. Don't know if you can tell, but it's stunning. I can't wait to put on my face. I also got these hair clips at Marshalls. These are my favorite freaking things. And I broke one of mine, so I only have one left. So I was really happy to find these $4. They have like grippy stuff inside. So if you have really slippery hair like me, these are a must. I was super excited. So mom got this really neat scarf we kind of showed you in the vlog. But it's like a diamond almost. Like the shape is so different mm -hmm. than any other scarf. And it's like a globe pattern. It's so awesome. Wait, show them your green shoes that you got. So mom got these really cool aerosol green shoes. They looked amazing on her. And they're like the comfy mm -hmm. type. And what they were, how much? 26. Oh my god. So they're gorgeous. We took pictures of ourselves oh, yeah. Yeah. at lunch. 
Dad wants to hear all about our day, obviously. Mom's going through a wallet she hasn't used in a long time. She found these Lady Gaga art rave tickets from 2014 when we went right after my, like it was between my senior week and my graduation from college. Oh my God, great mems. So you guys, I invented this yesterday. If you want a soft shell taco and a hard shell taco, pretend you're Taco Bell, put cheese on one side of the soft shell, put the hard shell in, sprinkle more cheese on the hard shell. It'll mostly get down here. All right, 15 seconds. Just let it do its thing. And I'm a cooking genius, you guys. So now that it's been 15 seconds, it's very warm. So you're gonna fold it over, it's gonna stick. You can do five more seconds. I like to flip it to the other side. Just get it kind of even. Now you have super delicious, cheesy, crunchy, yet soft taco shell. Ta-da! <laughs> I'm in the middle of vlogging and dad just starts asking us if we want to watch Prometheus. <laughs> I'm just so natural. <laughs> but I've tried a lot of um, sea salt. I guess it does just sound like I'm talking to mom. But then you interject a question as I'm talking either way. <laughs> okay, so I've tried a lot of sea salt caramels with like the chocolate. Uh, covered and these are my favorite ones and Gina bought these for us from Aldi and they are bomb I've had some from Whole Foods Trader Joe's and probably other places and these are definitely my favorite Ooh, They have a oh my god. We were just talking about that Camp Rock. They have a whole um, Category about flashback Disney Channel movies <laughs> High School Musical <laughs> what is high school music? Yes, I love Disney this. Channel Two teen rivals team up after one of the kids they're watching goes missing in 2016's <gasps> Adventures in the 2016, I don't know. William, what is babysitting? Right. Wow, that guy knows his Disney Channel. <laughs> so the one thing I didn't realize about the massage was that they were gonna like massage your face and your hair. So my hair when I got done with the massage was like a triangle. It was like so hilarious. Um, so I just spent like a good few minutes combing it out because there was so many like knots and stuff from that massage. And so I just, oh my gosh, it was freaking hilarious. And all my makeup, I was only wearing that Dr. Dark color correcting treatment, which is amazing. Um, but it's like all rubbed off. So I've looked crazy for the whole day, but I'm going to dye my hair with this barcoded lady. Um, this is the L'Oreal Paris Feria Deep Intensity Violet. I've dyed my hair with this a few times and this is, I always buy like if I like a hair dye and I see it on sale, I buy it. So I usually have a few hair dyes on hand for whenever I need to dye my hair. And I desperately need to dye my hair. So I am going to do that, probably watch some YouTube videos. I'm loving this crazy flexible tripod that I have you guys on and I'll link it down below if any of you are interested in something like that. It's hugging my, um, skincare like shelf and it just is so awesome you could put it anywhere you want um but i am gonna get because on my phone i have one of these like pop sockets and there's a like thing like an attachment that you can put on like a mirror or on any surface and then like slide it in to like have it up on a wall and i would love to do like instagram lives or like instagram stories with you guys in my bathroom like doing sheet masks or skincare whatever um or even just watching youtube videos like putting up my phone and being able to watch would be so awesome so i ordered that and that should come probably tomorrow so we'll give it a test drive but i'm really enjoying like finding different ways to make vlogging easier and just like have set up things so i can do it when i want to do it like this is going to be so awesome for showing you guys skincare and i might do a mask tonight i haven't decided yet um, but I just desperately need to dye my hair because girl looking crazy. And I forgot to tell you, 
I remembered to grab my hairdresser's clips, which will help with like sectioning, especially to get to like the underside of my hair. And um, I haven't done this in a long time, but when I rewatched one of my videos, I rediscovered this technique and this helps so much to get like all I'm like dropping them um to get like all the layers of your hair especially if you have a lot of hair like me these just are incredible I am obviously in the process of waiting for my hair to be not psycho ass crazy um but I was just like hmm maybe it's time to get a new piercing because I have wanted I have my ear piercing chart on my phone <sighs> I have been wanting to get my rook pierced for years, literally years, and I always chicken out of it. I think it might be time. I think it might be time, possibly. I wanted to get my rook pierced and my date, which is like here, but I think the rook is what I would get. Um, I also like this pierced. This says that this is called the Antitragus. The Rook. I think it might be time. I'm not sure. Putting this out in the universe. Let's see what happens. But possibly I will get a new piercing this week. But you never know. <laughs> so since the last time I saw you rinsed out my hair, it's going to look amazing tomorrow. I just love to keep it in one of these it's like a turby twist but they're better from target i'll link them below it's amazing and also i found that lunch box that i got today i found it at target for pretty much like the same price so i'll have that link down below and also i made a appointment for my piercing for tomorrow so i can't chicken out so i am gonna get my rook i think i'm gonna do it on this side on the left side but I always tuck my hair behind my right ear and I have this piercing on this ear too. So I have to decide, but I keep like pointing to this ear. So I feel like maybe it's meant to be on this ear, but I like looked up reputable places here, found one that gets really great reviews, made an appointment. So it's gonna happen tomorrow. I am like going batshit crazy this week. I'm having so much fun just like doing all this stuff that I wanted to do. Um, but yeah, so that's tomorrow. We'll see how it turns out. I cannot wait. I'm scared, but I'm excited. Um, so new hair, got a massage, getting a piercing. What else is next? So <laughs> thanks you guys so much for hanging out with me and my mom today. It was such a great day to spend with her and so relaxing and just such a great day spent. So thanks for being here and I'll see you really soon. Bye.